How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. Today we are going to attempt to get to an asteroid. I know the, the whole endurance thing has fallen apart at the moment, but again, I need more time to fix the damn thing because it is broken beyond repair right now. Stuck in orbit. Hello, Valentino. Is she always there? I don't know. Uh, what one are we going to go for? Default. Um, yeah, I don't know why, but I just wanted to try something else because I couldn't be bothered to just go up there and be like, oh, we're going to do fixing the endurance this time. Uh, that would just been boring as bollocks. So <laughs> we are going to attempt to basically do a monumental docking or rendezvousing, I, I guess it's called. Uh, instead of doing it to the endurance, which is this close to Earth, or Kerbin, if you have to be specific. Um, we're going to try these instead. Now, I don't know, I should have really checked the grade. So, the higher the letter, the higher the class size letter means the larger they are. So, E is huge, B is small, A is tiny. And the reason for this is what I'm going to attempt to do is use that new mining stuff. So then I can actually, I think this is how it works, I don't actually know. Um, I just quickly watched a video just to see the very, I just skipped through it, just to see the basics of how you get to this. It is basically like docking, but just way, way larger. So we've got to attempt to get to somewhere on one of these. The problem is, these are going to go past us, I think. Oh, that one's above us. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We're going to the rocket building now. I'm going to be using the nuclear engines for this. Again, like I said, I don't want to do the endurance thing just because it's painlessly broken at the moment. We will do it. I, I'm determined to get that thing to actually work. I got it in orbit, which took six years, but hey-ho. Now, I believe all we need is this and a container for ore, because that kind of makes sense. Oh, yes, 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 yes. This thing, I believe, is it. We stuffed that on the bottom. Never mind. <laughs> oh! Aha! I found it! A large holding tank. Or, yes. Okay, that is what we need. Oh my god. Yes, we can put it in a tube. And then, like, fire it open. Oh, that's so cool. Oh my god. It's a flower. Ah. <laughs> oh my god, that's weird. Whoop. Whoop, whoop. Something tells me this is going to use a crap ton of fuel. Oh no, we can't have four. That's dumb. If we, can't, if we have four, one of them is just going to hit the asteroid as we dock onto it. No, it won't. What am I talking about? Brain! Shut up. Okay, this is starting to look cool. So this is going to be the fuel tank that this fills up. But then I might have a few extra smaller fuel tanks sort of attached to this one on the outside. Oh! Uh, one other thing. Where the fudge do these go? Where are they? How the hell am I supposed to attach that to that? How do I do that? <laughs> these things are huge! Oh, I'm worried now. <laughs> I'm worried that these things ain't gonna work. Oh, not two. Boom. So what we do is we go up there, and as we're lining up with it, you don't have to piss around with how to dock it and make sure they snap in together. You literally just deploy that and then slam into it, and then it'll pop on, I believe. All I know is that the grabbing unit is what that's for, right? It's a grapple node, yeah. So it's basically the same as a docking node, yet it doesn't require another docking node to attach to it. I'd better be right on that. <laughs> Okay, I believe I have something that will work. I have no idea if that is true, but we will find out. <laughs> it is basically the same as the more is better rocket that I made. That was actually a pretty good rocket, but I did it like this because I've had a really bad issue recently where I keep putting the main rocket on the top and then building a crap ton of stuff under it so it just wobbles about all the time. But obviously when you slot it down inside it, like this, it is a lot more stable. Mac is going to be our main pilot for this mission. I wish Jeb was here. And Bill and Bob. 
but they they're all stuck. <laughs> all right. Uh, yeah, I don't see why we should wait around. Let's uh, just do this. Oh, this thing's quick. <laughs> uh. <laughs> God. Okay, we're dropping those. What the fuck just happened? Recover! Why does SAS suck absolute penis? Oh, because I have none. Dull. Oh. We're not going to the moon. We're going beyond the moon. I've been beyond the moon many a time, and it has never ever been very successful. Has one mission I've done past the moon been successful? I don't think it has, you know. <laughs> okay, that's nice. That is nice. Okay, we're good. Shit, shit, shit. No! Fuck you. Release. We're losing a lot of speed. Why? Fucking stupid thing. Okay, I don't know how I'm doing this, but I'm doing it. We are, uh, we're bloody high up though. <laughs> we're not where we should be. Maybe you do now need to go higher than 100,000-ish. Because the gravity pull is still way too much, so if you go arse over tit, it's just gonna whoop and flip you over and aim you straight at the ground. That's probably what it is, you know. You have to aim higher now. Okay, we're at a hundred-ish thousand. I'm going to make our turn. And try and get a circular orbit. Not that that really matters too much. Okay, right, I'm in orbit. It might not look like anything's changed, but I actually started again from the ground and tried to make the turn a bit quicker because we lost so much fuel, I literally ran out. So, uh, but now we got this amount. Hopefully that's enough to play with, uh, but we are in orbit. The orbit's very similar, actually, but it's a bit lower. Um, so, yeah. Uh, something I did notice. Is that a runway? Where are we on the side of the planet? We're there. I know it's just a smidge, but it looks like a runway. Anywho, right, we need to... Um, <laughs> we're going so far. Uh, can we get to this? Okay, that's a huge one. Right. We could... That wasn't what I meant to do. Uh. See, now, how do we make that our target? Can I even do that? Oh, I bet I have to get out of orbit before I can do it. I'll save before I do that, because <laughs> we could be wrong. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, I want more fuel. Please tell me that's enough. Yes! I'm trying to keep as much of the external rockets fuel. I know we're gonna get more, but I'm so reluctant to trust these engines. I don't know why. <laughs> I hate these things. Although they're really efficient, they're so slow. Like, they're terrible. And poof, there we go. Okay, now we're in orbit of the sun. Okay, so. How on earth do I track these? Classy objects are proper behemoths. No less than 18 meters in radius. They don't just look heavy. They are in fact more massive than it would seem. All day. How do I track it? Track object. Aha ha! Right. So now that is being tracked, isn't it? Yes. So now I can set it as target. Okay. Wow, they're actually quite close already. Holy shit, they're actually c right next to each other. Ooh! This could be useful. But it's not a matter of getting them really close like that. It's a matter of getting them... ...relative to each other. 
like this. So they stay closer together for longer. Right. I think that's it. Okay, we're going to stick with 11. Why, you may ask? Because reasons. Mac, Jenkin, and Fiomul. We're going to an asteroid. It's going to be Armageddon all over again. That's what this, that's what this is. Rescuing the world. I can't remember how Armageddon... I can't really remember that film. Oh, shit. We're almost out. Let's just keep going until we run out. There we go. Was it meant to do that? I don't know. Okay, I've just realized I need to be going faster than the asteroid. Because I want to go in reverse towards it. Give it more speed! Yes! Yeah, fuck you, asteroid. I'm beating you now. Oh, God. Um... Help. <gasps> That's it! It's two kilometers away. Swap the target. It just looks so wrong. Like... <laughs> Maybe point at it? <laughs> I don't know. This is so... I hate rendezvousing with stuff. It's so damn difficult for me. My brain just can't figure it out. I'm apparently pointing at it, but it's apparently there. I am such a penis. I am a monumental penis. I bet there was a lot of people screaming at me there. You're looking at the wrong thing! <laughs> <laughs> We're going to blast towards it quite fast, and then we'll see. We'll see what happens. Still five million away. Three point five million. Oh, that is bloody close. <laughs> Anti-target, slow down. Wait, no, is it anti-target one away, Matt? We'll soon find out. Now look, they're freaking out because we're getting really close to this thing. Holy shit, we're 3,000 meters away. It's tiny, I can't see it. It's not exactly a kilometer wide asteroid, is it? It's absolutely teeny. Okay, I really should have slowed myself down, shouldn't I? Probably would have been a good idea. That might have been too quick. <laughs> it's like a really small moon. That's what it's like. Seriously, I did not expect to be able to do this. I really didn't. I'm coming in a lot slower. Da -da! We are attached. Look at my rocket compared to it. My rocket's quite small to compared to it, to be honest. And it's like smooth on one side. Oh my god, this thing's so cool. I like it. We can actually move it, though. That's the cool thing. I can actually move this thing. Is it still on a collision course? It is. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if that's a collision course. It might be. Kerbin escape, so... No, it is. It's going to enter the orbit of Kerbin, whether it will hit it or not. We could put this in orbit. No, we've got... The engines are too damn small. We can, we'll try. We'll, we will try. Uh, there's no reason not to try. So now we're, we're on this asteroid, we can deploy our drills and try and fill up... Uh, we'll start, we'll do that in a minute. We'll try and fill up our rocket. Turn on the drill. And that's going, that's good. And that one's going too. Is this working now? 100% load. Uh, aha! Yes! Okay, so this is filling up with ore. Which then is being processed, as far as I know, into fuel, is it? Yes! Wait, yes! That is going up. I thought that was going down for a minute. <laughs> well, that actually worked, really. I did not expect that to work for some reason. <laughs> okay, while that does that, uh, are we still filling up relatively? Yeah, we're filling up quite slowly. Oh, look, we're depleting it of everything. 
Rename asteroid. Oh my god, what should we name it? Gary. <laughs> hey, I renamed it. Why are you no Vic? Right, we're filling up really slowly, so we're going to be here a while. Where did he get out? There you are. Don't walk into the drill. For the love of God. Or the solar panel. That would be bad too. Yeah, look at me. Ooh. This thing's so pretty. Oh. So small. But it's like it doesn't have any gravity or anything. So if I... Oh, is it, I don't think it does. Oh. Yeah. Whee! <laughs> yeah, you're loving it. We've mined some fuel. Now, just for a great ending, we are going to uh, see this thing crash into Earth. Because who doesn't want to see that happen? <laughs> it's warp time. So I've done it. I have uh, successfully completed my mission. Can't see the Earth. Here we go, here we go, here we go. That's going to collide. It's going to get grabbed by its gravity, definitely. I made it back, bitches. It might not, actually. No! Fuck. Quick, quick, quick. We'll add a maneuver. We can put this thing in orbit. <laughs> I'm going to put a huge rock in orbit. Where is the Earth? Oh, there it is. Ah. And there's the moon. We're basically home, guys, and we bought a present. <laughs> this would be the best Christmas present. It would be, actually. Could you imagine how much you could sell an asteroid for? I mean, that's what people did in Russia, didn't they, when that one crashed? People were looking for the parts to sell. Because they're apparently worth... A fuckload of money. We could, like, build a base on this thing. Oh, no, 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 no. Now, 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 now it's a... Now it's a long time. <laughs> and we're going off course as well. No, we can't. We can't put this in orbit. Oh, that sucks. Now it is Armageddon. I'm, I'm, I'm sending this one away from Earth. I think that's how I, I've forgotten the Armageddon film. All I know is they went up to an asteroid and they started drilling it. Don't know why they started dr drilling it. I can't remember. I think it was because it was going to hit Earth and it was going to be like a dinosaur thing all over again. Okay, I've been pissing around, like, every time it rotates, I've been firing it a little bit. And I think I've got it in an orbit. It's a bad one, but I think it's in orbit. Yeah! I got it in orbit! Well, I've done, like, two challenges in... Oh, Jesus. I've done, like, two challenges in one. So what we can now do is detach this and send this back down. But... The thing is, this has no heat shields and will kill Theomor, Mac, and Jenkin. I think we're going to leave it there. <laughs> well, we're in orbit with an asteroid and there's now three more Kerbals stuck up in space. Well, there we are, everyone. That was the uh, driving to an asteroid slash sucking stuff out of it uh, Armageddon challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys soon. Stay tuned. Stay awesome. Goodbye.